have to be honest, it is hard to talk about Donald Trump. Between his ignorance, his racism, his sexism, his lies, it is actually hard to know where to start. But we gotta start somewhere. And today I wanna to focus on one lie that helps sum up what Donald Trump is all about, his taxes. You know, we don't actually know what Donald Trump pays in taxes because he is the first presidential nominee in 40 years to refuse to disclose his tax return. I believe there's a bombshell in his taxes. There's a bombshell there. Look, maybe he's just a lousy businessman who doesn't want you to find out that he's worth a whole lot less money than he claims. We just really can't know for sure. Here's what we do know. The last time Donald Trump's taxes were made public, it turned out that Donald Trump paid nothing in federal taxes. Zero. Zero taxes before. And for all we know, he's paying zero taxes today. And he's proud of it. A few weeks ago, he said that he's more than happy to dodge taxes because he doesn't want to throw his money down the drain. Yeah, Trump likes being a billionaire. And he doesn't think that the rules that apply to everyone else should apply to him. But let's be clear, Donald Trump didn't get rich on his own. His businesses rely on roads and bridges that the rest of us paid for. His businesses rely on workers the rest of us paid to educate. And on the great police force and brave firefighters the rest of us paid to support. Donald Trump and his businesses are protected by a world-class military that defends us abroad, keeps us safe at home, and the rest of us pay to support. When anyone builds something terrific, they should get to keep a big hunk of it, but they should also pay a fair share forward. So the next kid and the next kid and the next kid who come along will get their chance to build something too. That's how we build a future that works for everyone. And that goes double for Donald Trump, because we know how he got rich. He inherited a fortune from his father and kept it going by scamming people, declaring bankruptcy, and skipping out on what he owed. Nurses, teachers, dock workers, they paid their fair share for the services that keep Trump's businesses going. Programmers and engineers and small business owners, they paid their fair share to support courageous first responders. Donald Trump thinks that supporting them is throwing money down the drain. I say we just throw Donald Trump down the drain. Donald Trump is a fraud and a cheapskate and he's a bully. And look, he's probably gonna come up with a whole bunch of lame new nicknames for me just for filming this video. You know why he does that? He does it to intimidate, to threaten, to make us shut up. You and I know how to beat him. We don't back down. So here's what we need to do. Whatever Donald Trump says, whatever scam he tries to pull, whatever disgusting thing he thinks he can say because he's Donald Trump, Speak out. Talk to the person behind you in the grocery store. Talk, talk to the person pumping gas next to you. And yeah, share this video with your friends. Ask your Fox News loving Republican uncle, why do you pay your taxes, but Donald Trump doesn't? If Donald Trump doesn't even believe in paying his fair share for government, we shouldn't put him in charge of the government. If we're gonna build a future, that's not just for the rich and powerful, but a future that's for everybody, that it's time for all of us to fight back.